Can't do this without my hat. There we go. There we go. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Hope that you're having a fantastic day. Today, we are listening to Patrick Watson. Uh, we're going to listen to his song Fireweed. This is off of his album Wooden Arms, which was released in 2009. So I was gifted this album and a few others and this very comfortable shirt uh, recently. So I figured, you know what? Let's go ahead and give a listen to the album. Here's what the inside of it looks like. And I'm so sorry if you guys hear the cicadas outside. There are a lot of them. They do be buzzing. <laughs> so I've never heard of Patrick Watson before uh, seeing this. So I have no idea what this will be. However, this was part of a gift from a folk festival, the shirt of which I'm wearing, over in Canada. Uh, so, I figured let's uh, let's jump into what I would only assume is a little bit of folk. You are more than welcome to join me on Twitter in the comments below. Hope you're having a fantastic day. I can hear them. Let's do it. This is Patrick Watson with Fireweed. If you've ever gone on an early morning hike, it's cold, it's misty, you're walking through the woods, it's foggy, 
it's about five, six in the morning. And that one particular moment when you're walking in nature, it's quiet, and the first beams of sunlight burn through the fog and shine down, and you feel that first glimpse of heat on your skin. That's exactly what is personified in the music here from Patrick. This was great. I would love to know what you guys thought of this. I thought this was fantastic. I have to see exactly what Patrick is doing because I've never heard of him, so I don't know exactly what part he has in the music. I would imagine at least the singing. I thought that this was great. Wonderful guitar playing to open it up. Nice, soft-spoken vocals that are just kind of like a fog, just kind of like mist in the air. The structure of the song is also really interesting, like the arrangements of everything coming forward into the music. The drum pattern is very modern, very very fast paced, but very rhythmic. The bass is pumping and powerful, has a lot on the deep end. Like everything just came together really well in this track. I would I would like to hear more. Um, let me just come into the personnel list and see if I can figure out exactly who's doing what, because I would like to, you know, appropriately hand out <laughs> whatever compliments I may have. So Patrick Watson is, of course, the um, P oh, not pianist, I'm sorry. Well, he does play the piano. Uh, the guitarist, the pianist, the vocals, Mellotron in this album? It's <laughs> one word, I, that's the only word I need to hear. Organ, the arrangements, so he is like in control of it all. Um, the bass is played by Mishka Stein, uh, Robbie Custer on drums and percussion, and there's a lot of people doing a lot of different things. So this sounds like an album that feels very light, and yet there's a lot of depth to it. It almost reminds me a little bit of the sound you may get from a group like Sigurose. A kind of post-rockish kind of sound. I don't know if I would necessarily put this in that category. I mean, I've only heard one song and I've never heard of Mr. Watson before. But if the rest of the music moves in a similar pattern, or at least takes you on those type of journeys, then I'm in for it. Absolutely. The lyrics on this album. After all the flames in the morning, quiet ashes fell for hours and hours. And in the morning rise, we planted our skin like a seed in, a gra in the ground. So we dug ourselves a hole and planted all our skin like a seed in the ground to grow again, where the fire weeds grow, which is repeated in the end of the song. So this could be perhaps about death and rebirth, being burned up, weeds being burned up, and the ashes of which are the seeds for whatever things are to grow next. He says that we planted our skin like a seed in the ground. We dug ourselves a hole and planted our skin like a seed in the ground to grow again. So I think that that's what it's possibly about. <laughs> I don't know, but it sounds like that's the thing that it's going for. Death, destruction, rebirth, planting a seed, the seed being ourselves, into which we, or at least new generations further ahead, will grow. I don't know. This was great. This is, I would love to know what you guys thought, though. Let me know curious did you like it did you not like it i i mean i, I can't imagine you not liking it <laughs> like people are, this is grooving and calm love when the harmonies come in it's beautiful and there are a few slightly abstract moments in here and i mean very slightly like it's a passing moment but it, it just adds so much depth to the music um, I mean, the, the deep bass here. That's the movement of it all. Nice dual vocals there. It just comes together. Let me know what you guys thought, though. Join me in the comments. Follow me on Twitter. Hope you enjoy the music. And hope you come back tomorrow. Thanks for being here. <laughs> Bye.